Hello and welcome to my new first video of 2018. It's been a while since I uploaded any video. The reason for that was I wanted to take a look on a new way to implement my new videos and to make them more informative and useful. Today I'm going to walk you through the update process for the B350 from ASUS. This method should work on all ASUS B350 motherboards. First, picking up the right motherboard model number. You can simply do that by looking at the motherboard box. In my case, it is the B350F. Number two is to download the right motherboard's BIOS file that you need to be able to do the update. Number three, have a USB stick. You can do the update with and without a USB stick. It is pretty similar and for the sake of simplicity, I will show you both ways. After downloading the new BIOS file, you need to locate that file and it is by default in the download folder. You need to extract that file and you can do that by using WinRAR for example or whatever you have installed on your PC. Now after extracting the file, you can whether skip using the USB part if you don't have a, a flash drive lying around and just copy the file to the root of any hard drive that you have. Now for getting the USB stick ready, you don't need a lot of storage, so any flash drive should do the job. But you do need to make sure that your USB flash drive or hard drive has the right file system to avoid any problems. Before you start, you need to back up your files that you stored on your USB flash drive or hard drive because this will erase all the information that you stored on it. When it's done, just copy the extracted file onto the USB stick. Now you need to restart your computer and while it's booting, just press the DAL button or the delete button to enter the BIOS. If you're having a problem to know when exactly to press that button, just keep on spamming the button until you enter the BIOS. In the BIOS, you can see the BIOS version and the date for the existing BIOS that you have on your motherboard under the main tab. Click on the tool tab using your mouse. Then select the first option, which is Flash Utility Tool 3, or the Flash Tool Utility 3, or Easy Flash Tool. Click Enter. A window will pop up asking you on how do you want to update the BIOS. Select from a flash drive, then hit Next. Now what you see on the left is basically all the partitions that you have on your PC, but without any names. So to know which one is the right one, you can do that by looking at the numbers near each partition, which describes how much storage is associated to it. Now if you didn't use your flash drive, then just select the partition that you saved the BIOS file on, then hit enter. It will ask you if you want to read the file, and in my case I will cancel it because I want to do it through the USB hard drive or the USB flash drive. After hitting yes, a progress bar will show up. The update will take about 5 to 10 minutes. Then it will automatically restart the PC. After restarting, it will show you something like this. Just click F1 and enter the BIOS again. And you can see now that your motherboard BIOS has been updated. Click F10 to save and leave the BIOS. Just a quick note that the first boot after the BIOS update may take longer than usual, and that is totally okay. After booting, you might also experience weird stuff like driver issues or programs that are not running. Just restart your PC and you should be fine. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below. Hope this helped you out. If it did, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to watch more videos like this, then go ahead and subscribe. Thanks again, and I will see you soon.